Welcome back to Dungeons and Desktops. Hello! We just missed a thing. Yeah, I don't know what it was. So we, we left because um, I heard that Durance has some things that happens if he's along with this quest in the wolf head, okay. as it were. Uh, so we had Pull to go get him. For the mall, actually. Uh, yeah, uh, for the mall. Yeah. So we pulled him off <laughs> yeah. so. his, his quest. Uh, we decked him out in Palagina's hand-me-downs and a gun, because I guess there's a feat that Mogren people can take that makes them good with guns. So that's his thing now. Mm -hmm. Also, a lovely little crown of laurels. Lavender. Whatever. It's not the same. It's all the same. It's soothing and irritating. Irritating to others, yeah. I guess. Anyways, we, we came back here, and we walked up these stairs accidentally, because I meant to go over there. And... Some kind of weird soul crap happened, like the screen there was changed. There a bunch of souls like standing in a line on yeah. the other side of the stairs. But we totally missed it, so. Yeah, we weren't recording at the time. Whatever, so. we're going back Sorry. inside. Did we come from that way, or is it telling us to go up the way that the souls were? When we came here, we went like straight in there. No, I know, I'm just saying just now, did we come from that side? No, okay. we came from down in the southeast uh, oh, corner. Okay. I was wondering if the spirits were telling us to go the other way. Maybe. I have no idea. Do you not do have I, any idea? Do I sound like I understand spirits? Yeah. Oh. A lot. Okay. You are always talking to those spirits. I don't know how I ever gave you that impression. By spirits, I mean alcohol. Well. Okay. You're drunk right yeah. now! <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I just need it for the pain. I can do a let's play with my underwear on my head. I'm fine. It's, it actually helps. <laughs> it helps with death perception. Death Perception? What? You're dead! Nah. <laughs> Good thing I was wearing my underwear on my head. Otherwise I wouldn't know. I rolled a low perception yeah. check. Okay, well here. We're back here. Yay! So let's take him. Oh, uh, let's talk to him. Maybe he has commentary. I don't know. Uh, Something ate Never mind. You. Okay, we've already asked Yeah, him your that. face. I didn't miss Durance that much. <laughs> <laughs> I know. He's okay. I do kind of like him. He's the grumpy old guy. Yep. He's the uh, Zaid of our party. He's the grumble grums. Okay, so we're back. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, right. That's what we're doing. I forgot temporarily. What? Why was she out? I thought she was like the Heidi one. I thought so too. Um. Um. Maybe we were supposed to follow there we go. her. Maybe it thought we were lost or something. Yeah, maybe. Soul Linus has held that position for decades. Okay. <laughs> well, we cured her. Good job. <laughs> Yay. All right, I guess we'll go so, this I kind of wonder if maybe it thought, oh, oh hey, traps. Fighting an elder lion also oh, look traps. Out. Oh, crap. I forgot we don't have her anymore. So, um, yeah. Grieving mom. Yeah, we swapped out grieving mother. But, oh, whoa. Yes, she so made that elder lion explode. Kill it. Oh, and some guys. Hey. Um, Wait, so if we fight... Do we help or not? I think we help. Do you want to help? Because she's going to die. Uh, I want, I, I don't, yeah, let's help her. Sure. Is it going to be too late? Oh, no, traps. Oh, she boy. She died, probably. Yep. No, no. she's still she alive. Didn't. Near death. Yeah. Lion Plainsman. Can oh, and also, Durance, her? are you, uh, maybe. I can, I can try. That'd be interesting. I guess so. Yeah. Oh, we did it. We helped her. Yeah. She is a big lion. Oh, no. It said knocked out. Oh, that was the other one. That was, yeah, the other one. I see. Hey, giant lion Okay, lady. I don't know if that was good. Because, I mean, isn't like this they all about red, nature's order so... and shit? Well, yeah. <laughs> That's true. They were red, so we had to get them. All right, well. Okay. I guess see ya. Oh, what's that blue? That's a cave. Dumb. My eyes are peeled. It's a stupid branch. You're a branch. A uh, thick snarled tangle of dagger, sharp thorns, and vines has grown across this passage. As you look on, the entire wall of vegetation seems to move, almost like it were breathing. Thick coils of vines twist and writhe across the gap with a quiet rustle of foliage and a s small scent foliage. of lavender. Oh, there's dirt. From dirt. He pooted. <laughs> <laughs> he swallowed his own laurels. Yeah. Not laurels, it's lavenders! Nope, it's. Is that actually a type of flower? I thought laurel was just the name of, like, having flowers around your head. I think laurel is, like, a type of leaf. Oh. I think that's what those little crowns are made out of. Well, shit. I think. I could totally be wrong. All right, maybe we'll find but, out. Comments, tell uh, us. Let's try to sneak through the living wall. 
Uh, you find a brief opportunity as two vines move in opposite directions, clearing a path and carefully step forward. You start off well, uh, wall, well, wall. moving carefully around and past the web of plants, but halfway through, Edder steps on a dry dead branch and the vine suddenly darts forward with unnatural You speed. son of a bitch, Edder! The vines tighten mercilessly around Edder's leg and the ensuing struggle shakes the surrounding vegetation, stirring it into a writhing frenzy. Edder finally tears their way free and limps out past the edge of the wall. You step out into the next chamber. I'm looking up worlds. Oh. Oh, there's lions in here. And clans women that aren't that aren't meanies. Oh, it's Galloway Shrine. Oh boy. Hey. What? There's a thing. Whoa! Um an elven woman intercepts you as you advance into the lair. Behind her is the largest lioness you've ever seen, a sleek beast oh. with fangs as long as carving knives. The woman blocks your path to the lioness, seeming at ease around the monster. This is Sewell's domain, Esther Moore. She shall not leave it for Ornos or any other child but she was just outside, wasn't she? Yeah. Was it Sewell or it Soul said Sewell. that we saw out there? What? It said S-U-L. Oh, wait. Yeah, I know, but the one outside, was that Sewell? Yeah, there's only the one. Okay, well, she was fighting the other one. I don't know. Well, yeah, but the other line but just said fighting. lion. Yeah. Um. Like, the big one said Sewell. Why does Sewell refuse to face Ornos? Ornos is welcome to confront her here, as many challenges have in the past. What the Bear's supporters want is for Sewell to leave her there and fight in the open, where he has an advantage. But why would she? If Sewell has an advantage here, it's one she earned. Would anyone expect to blunt the bear's claws in order to even the odds? No. The Lord of the Hunt gives unique advantages to each. It's not for us to decide that some of them are worth less than others. That's true. Relinus gives a low growl and Irinzi smiles. Also, Sewell has recently given birth to cubs. Oh my gosh. They're small now, but when they grow, they'll be mightier than either Sewell or Ornos. But if Sewell is killed in combat, that bear will tear her young to shreds. Such is the way of the wild. Her legacy is too valuable to perish this way. If we truly want the mightiest of beasts in the maw, then her cubs must grow to maturity. Hmm. Let's see, what are you doing here with Sewell? Uh, she looks at the lion with something between fondness and admiration. Defending the rightful champion of Galloway's maw, Ornos' supporter would have her ousted in favor of a bear that isn't strong enough to come and seize his territory on his own. Well, so then, are we supposed to kill the bear? Because that's still, like, interfering. Yeah, I don't know. So... We can go... Figure it out. There's more places to explore. Yeah, I guess let's go explore a little more. In the state. Whoa. 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 Oh. Oh. I found bears. the bears. Hey, big bear. Oh, Ooh. he's rumbling. Look at him rumbling. Oh, there's whispers. Okay. Okay, well, let's go talk to a bear. I'm looking down this way. Okay. It looked like I could go this way, so I'm going this you way. You might be able to. Might go outside or something. Ah! Oh. Look out! See nothing while I see oh, one. shit. Sorry, lions. Wait a minute. We still have Grieving Mother. Yeah. I, I got rid of um the rogue instead. Oh. Maybe you weren't paying attention. I, I, I swapped out oh, I thought you would Grieving Mom originally, okay. and then I took her back because I wanted her instead of Well, then now I feel stupid. I was like, we left her behind! No. Derp, derp. Also, everyone is tired. And then I... Major fatigue. Well. That's we probably because we came here without camping. Well. Yeah, no. My fault. What the? That guy's a creepy guy. Oh, he's a lion clanswoman. Oh. She. She. Actually. She did a little, like, scoot without moving her feet. I don't think she meant to. No. I don't think so either. How you doing back there, Durrance? Just hanging out with my lavender. What are you on? Support? <laughs> what are you on, Durrance? And self-defensive? Oh, I'm still looking up laurels. I was, and then I had to pay attention. I guess you could be aggressive now, Durrance. Because he has a good gun. He doesn't have to worry about getting him in melee anymore. Laurel. Any of a number of shrubs and other plants with dark green glossy leaves, in particular, an aromatic Starting evergreen shrub neighbor, so. related to the bay tree. Oh. Several kinds of which form forests in tropical and warm countries. But I guess any of them... Oh, boy. Well... So, like, resting on your laurels is a phrase, and that just kind of refers to yeah. a little crowny crown. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, Whoa. Soul thing. What else is down here? Where are we going? Only one way to find oh. out. It's hey. another bridge of these. Oh, okay. It. it just circles back ah, around. Okay. Right, well, let's, we'll go talk to the bear people. <laughs> I found it. You did it. Good job. Ugh. Yes. Miss Devil of Karak and her, like, Tiny lightning bear vision. Bear people? <laughs> yeah. Oh, there's a trap. What's that? It's another trap. What is it? What do you think it is? What is it? Oh, my God. So and there's a lever? Looks like it. Yes. Alloc thinks yes. Well, then, I guess he would know. He would. 
Oh. Oh, what's that? It leads a back. Way out. Oh, so we can. Yeah. Oh, I see. Hi there, little friends. Uh, hey. We haven't, talked, we haven't talked to you. An Orland oh my woman. Gosh. Uh, you must. You want to read her? Sure. You must be Bethel's new Estramore. Truth, when I heard she let another in, I almost went to the passage of the six myself to share words. Uh, she points the flint spearhead at you. Um, let's see. Have other foreigners come this way recently? Lamfelon, worshippers of Rimgrand, they claim. Simply looters and defilers by another name. That's the truth. And the spearhead flashes as she shakes it at the door. They disappeared behind the doors of Noonfrost, and now our lake turns to ice and the cold creeps ever closer. Oh no! Uh, yet Bethel is timid, and she has convinced the other Anum father that we must respect these Estramorn and their traditions, no matter what mischief guides their hands. Hmm. Uh, let's see. Okay. Uh, I'm guessing you didn't leave it at that? Oh, you don't want to say the diplomatic? Oh, yeah, let's say that. Sorry. Uh, Bethel's looking after twin elms in her own way. Soft words accomplish a little, yet they fill the mouths of Estramorn. Oh. They're not soft, they're hard and crunchy words. <laughs> they just hate yep. all the Estramorn with our potato chip words. Yep. I sent my own sister, one of my finest scouts, to sniff out the Pale Elves' corruption. I was certain that uh, the Anum Father could not ignore the defilement in Noonfrost once Alwa's own eyes had seen it, but she still hasn't returned. Now, I bear the responsibility for her fate. And I can't send the fangs after her without openly defying the uh, Anna Father. Father, yeah. Okay. Um, I could look for her. Sure. I don't dare to hope. Whatever catastrophe has befallen the Noonfrost does not feel like the work of Kith. But nothing will bring me greater joy than seeing her again. I would take any assistance you can give. What are you doing here? Ah, my stocks equip my brethren in the fangs. And my hands train them to fight, hunt, and track with skill. What purpose brings you here? Oh, does she have supplies? I guess. I'm gonna ask her. Only oh, the finest! The finest! Oh, Bleak Fang, oh. Ray Karkonek, and Wee Toki! Wee Toki! Oh, I love Wee Toki! Oh my gosh, it's my favorite video game. Ooh, and uh, seven scolders worth. I can afford all of these things and have no desire for any of them. Aww. You guys should tell me if there's any shops that actually have really awesome shit that I should be using. Yeah. Oh, War Paint. Hmm. That's cool. What does that do? I don't know. Oh, good. Does a thing. <laughs> you know, I'm, buying this other I'm, shit. I'm glad you thoroughly researched it. Uh, it does plus 15 accuracy, plus 10 percent damage, and plus 20 percent maximum endurance for 20 seconds. Oh my Just gosh! Just so you know. Oh, also our storage is like we have so much shit. So I'm oh gonna sell something. Sell Hold all on. the things. Um, I guess I'll do load high. It doesn't really matter. Do you want to do that? Eh, it's it, whatever. That it's long. it's quick enough. I just gotta click. We need enough money. Oh my god, look We're at, not gonna have enough. Look at how much. I have five pages That's of armor. So many armors. Four pages. Oh god. Yep. Here we go. And when I was changing out Durance's armor earlier, it was actually like lagging when I was trying to go through the store. Oh my gosh. Because there was so much. Shit. Look at this. We're already oh up to like 30,000 co like, copper. <laughs> I don't know how we've been carrying any well, of this. Well, see, now this just, I mean, it really gives you some perspective on, like, your your job and stuff. Cause yeah. clearly, if you want to make a bunch of money, what you should do is just run around killing people and stuff oh, in their clothes. Oh, and take all their armor. Yeah. Just so much armor. Look at this. We've all almost... All clothes. This is, this is like a third of our money. Oh. Like, our total money. Yup. And I haven't even gotten to the weapons. Because ah! I already checked all of these, and I can't really use any okay. of them. Oh, my, oh God. my God. We're going to sell so many things. Uh, this is ten pages. We really want to do this. I'll fast forward recording. a little bit. Just, just, just fast forward uh, me. Be right back. Do, do, do. Okay, we're back. Ooh, that was a solid two how minutes. How is this person carrying... I mean, how, well, first of all, how do we carry all that crap? But this woman, this one woman, alone in this shrine of Galloway. Yeah. By herself with, you know, a rack of weapons and some armor. 
a, a few pieces of meat, milk, some more paint, has more money than our entire savings. She's really, really rich. We just over doubled our money. Not yet. No. We just we did. did it. <laughs> Holy shit. Woo! So now we can buy the whole world. Oh my god. Oh, and she wants me to do that. Enter Nude Frost and Old Song. Also, I forgot I'm going to enchant Durance's weapon because it's a, That's crazy it's a basic talk. bitch of a weapon. You're a basic bitch of a weapon. Thank you. <laughs> oh, so I can make stuff legendary now, but only... Ooh, yeah, I have Kraken eyes. eyes, but only like one thing. I can make like one weapon legendary. Uh, excuse uh, me, What ever... should his um, Arquebus, uh, whatever... Arcaboos. Should it be fiery, acidy, freezy? Or wait, he's the guy he's of fire. Fiery, yeah, so, yeah, so probably that. <laughs> and he hates Kith, so we'll just do that. I don't know, sure. Durgan reinforce. Oh, Durgan to find steel. We only have a little bit more of that, so I'm gonna save that. That's we fine. Should. Okay. Woo, yes. doggy. So, so we, we have were, money now. Yeah, all the months. And significantly lighter packs. Yeah, I mean, just... I, I really am curious how much all that weighed. <laughs> I apologize. I forgot to turn off the Facebook noise again. Oh, you son of a beast. I know. Whoops. You also forgot to not get hit by traps. Well, oh. Ah! Yeah, <laughs> I remember this time. Sure you did. Um, that wasn't totally. I just like walk her onto it. <laughs> You're, oh no! And what does the flame reveal? What does it reveal, Dirk? It reveals your butt. Is there nothing oh. down here? Why do we even go around this? What? Like yeah. I've had a long day, so my brain's just like. Nah, 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 okay, nah, so nah. they're over there doing their thing, and the bears are okay. over this way. Yes. That trying to go like. for the Super Bowl, whatever bears do. Bears are a football team, right? Yeah. I don't know why I'm asking you because you know as much no, about sports I as I do. No, I Chicago Bears oh. is the team. Good. Ah, no! I, don't walk on it! No, you dummy. Oh, what they're the, okay. Oh, look at their beautiful lights. Everyone's okay. What was that trap? It was Tangle a foot. Uh, I see. Oh, and it's still doing it. Oh, I see. So we were just stuck for a little bit. Oh, no. It's going away! Okay. Oh, we got stuck a tiny bit. This may be. Oh, go! God, what is up? Who is making these traps? Do Probably. lions and bears just learn the, the swift art of trap making? Yeah. That's why in The Wizard of Oz they say lions and bears and traps. Oh my. <laughs> Good. I guess it would be their, their people, their handlers, or whatever. Lions and traps and bears, I guess, oh. is the cor correct order. We found them. How much quick buddies. save? Just because I'm... That's a good idea. I'm worried the bear people seem a little tad more aggressive, although I don't really know the right way around this. Yeah. I'm trying to remember in that vision, because it didn't really tell us what to do. It just showed us the animals, like, facing off. It said right? they wait in a deadlock. Yeah. We have to resolve the stale conflict. Okay. And the stale conflict, uh, stalemate. Uh, Renzi well, explained... So, essentially, we're doing a trial yeah. of a bear and a lion. Mm hmm Let's hear the bear's case. Okay. I'll talk to you. You have a name. Hello. Find in size, spinning his act by the shaft. Too much waiting. Something's got to happen soon. Oh, so we just have to decide now. There's got to be another way around this. I mean, we can ask him. Why can't he? Because she's holed up at the back of the maw, surrounded by her pride and the natural hazards of this place. It's not the proper way to meet a challenger. She's got to come out and face Oernos to keep her claim. Hmm. Like, how bad? So, at least based on that, it looks like, yeah, we have to make a decision, but yeah. maybe there's, like, more we can do. So this also leads back into this room. Yeah. Um, uh, and do you have anything Still to say? Still looking around? Watch your step. Tempers run hot around here, and not just among the animals. Oh my gosh. Maybe he can tell us more. Okay. So there's um, a few things we got. Well, let's see. Um... Would you... F well, let's say, Sewell refuses to meet Ornos. Ornos doesn't seem willing to approach Sewell, either. I was afraid of that. He scratches his chin and frowns. At this point, it doesn't much matter which beast is champion so long as the issue is settled. I can't take a side, but you've been through the Maw. Slay one of the beasts in combat, and the Fanes will accept the other as a champion. It's the way of the Maw. Uh, Something else? I prefer action to talk, but I'll answer your questions as best I can. Which one would he favor? I want to know. I see both sides. Sewell's cunning is unmatched, but Ornos is the mightier of the two. Both embody traits prized by Galloway. Yeah. It sucks because, like, if it were humans, I would be like, yeah, come out and fight. Like, do your thing. But yeah. 
the laws of nature and like animals don't really have place for honor. Yeah. Pretty much, if the bear wants to fight her, he's got to figure out a way to fight her, and okay. then whoever wins. But we, if we have to kill one or the other, then that just feels kind of rude. Oh, so he's the leader of the fangs. Yeah. This guy. Okay. Well, so we have a bit more information. Um, Soul has given birth to cubs that could one day be mightier than either beast if allowed to mature. Yeah. Neither beast will approach the other. I will have to sell matters on my own. Indian believes that soul must be limited if she won't face or knows in open combat. Dash one has given me his blessing to slay one of the beasts. The fangs will accept the other as champion. Okay. And he's the leader of the fangs, yeah. so I mean, I guess if we have his blessing, that's great. I say we go for the bear. Okay. To be totally honest. Even though we are a bear? I mean, that's fine. Like, we yeah. totally can. I just feel like, one, she's the reigning champion, and if he won't fight her, then she's still the reigning champion by, yeah. by all... And she has cubs. Yeah, and she just had I mean, cubs. I guess he has people. Anyways. He's got elder bears. So we should get ready for this. Right. I'll get these guys up in melee. And yeah, we'll just, uh, I'll, I'll quick save. I'm nervous. Oh, it's okay. Don't be We're nervous. Fight the bears. Don't be nervous. Wait a minute! Is it time? I think it's time. Oh shit, we're gonna have to fight the bears next time? Oh, I don't But what about the people? Oh, People will just have to wait. Okay, if you say next so. Next time, we're fighting a bear! Bye! Bear. Bears.